Hey everybody. Well, today's video takes place in Truckee, California, uh, the Donner Summit, Donner Pass. But right now, I'm at the top of the Donner Summit. They call it the Highway 40 Scenic Bypass. From this point, I can see Donner Lake, and in the smoky distance, because we got a fire now near Yosemite, I guess. In the smoky distance, I can see Mount Rose. And then off to my right, over here, is the uh, Donner Snowsheds. I've been in there many, many times. It's difficult to get video in there because it is so dark. But what I'll do is I'll give you a panoramic of it. And uh, the smoke isn't going to help any, but, you know, it is what it is, right? It is what it is. So what I'll do is I'm going to spin this around and give you guys a view of uh, where I'm standing. And I hope you enjoy the video. If you do enjoy the video, please consider subscribing. And uh, let's do this. Enjoy the show. We'll start right here with a sign. I love these information signs. Let me tell you what's going on. Highway 40 Scenic Bypass. Now, I lived in this area way back in the 60s, actually before Interstate 80 was even built. So I saw a lot of this develop. The bridge right here, they call it the Rainbow Bridge now. I don't know if it's always been called that, but I know it's called that now. There's a plaque up here. Let's go up here and take a look at it. But there's the bridge. Goes on around. They're doing a lot of highway work up here. They're going to widen the road and add bicycle lanes and all that good stuff. But here they call it the Donner Summit Bridge, which is what I've always known it as. Uh, it's pretty historic. Restored in 1920, 1995. It was uh, built, it looks like in 19... 26 or 1925 we got conflicting things here looks like 1925 to 1926 okay and then from this point beautiful scenery i mean this area i actually love this area there's just so much here and it's very historic this is where the infamous or famous donner party came through for those of you who don't know, they're the first actual recorded episodes of uh, cannibalism. The poor souls got stuck right near that lake and couldn't make it up this hill. Nowadays, it's a resort, right? You can hike down underneath, underneath there. I've been down there, it's pretty cool. Maybe I'll hike down there and give you all a view of that. As we walk past, over here, along that mountainside, that's the Donner Snowsheds. That was a major problem when they were building the Transcontinental Railroad. At one point, they were making progress of maybe a foot a day. So, yeah, right now I think I'm gonna take you underneath. So I'll give you the grand tour. Take you under the bridge. Show you what it looks like. Um, nothing really spectacular, but it does give you a different perspective of everything. Rock climbers are real popular in this area. It's a sport I would never want to attempt. Well, let's take a look. They got construction going on, so we'll see how that that wraps up. Yeah, we got. Daredevils with helmets and ropes and chains and yeah. If I need mechanical assist, I'm not going there. So let's take a take a walk underneath here. I'll flip the camera around and show you where we're going. There we go.
So this is the back side of the bridge, or the underside, the underbelly. Pretty, pretty gnarly walking down here, but not too bad. I mean, I don't need specialty gear, that's for dang sure. So let's walk over here. I got a couple other events or spots I want to visit. before the day's over, but we'll see how that works out. Here's the bridge. 1925 to 1926 is when it was built. Pretty cool down here. Now that wreck down there, that rusty pile, I remember when that crashed. I was just a kid and that car went over. There's also a tanker over there somewhere and I believe my dad helped in the rescue of that one or however that turned out. I was just a kid, I was like five or six years old, but let's walk on down. But yeah, I spent my childhood down here. Not under the bridge, but <laughs> I'm not a troll. But uh, yeah, it's kind of rough walking, so you'll see the camera bounce around a bit because I don't want to trip and fall. Here's underneath that bridge. Now, I don't know that a river has ever gone through here, but there is one heck of a gap that looks like there may have been a river through here, maybe during the ice age, or just a fracture in the earth, I don't know. But yeah, it looks like maybe a river might have gone through here at one time and traveled on down. But uh, up there, construction. It'll be nice when they get this done. I probably won't be here when they get this done because I got a few things in the works that I'm doing. I'm relocating. I am leaving Reno, I'm leaving Nevada. Uh, in a few months, can't tell you exactly when, but in a few months you're gonna see videos more in tune with Oregon and Washington. But for now, we are right here. And you can walk right over to the edge and get some good, good views. Oh yeah, look at this, there you go. Now the sun is just starting to come up. So there's not gonna be a whole lot that you can see probably because that sun blocks out pretty much everything. Although I am pretty um, impressed with this camera phone or the camera on this phone. It does a pretty good job. Let's see, that's good, huh? Okay. Well now, let's uh, jump away from here and go on up. I wanna try to make a few stops. There's some of the little lodges and things like that that are on the way. And uh, try to squeeze them in. It's a beautiful day. It's right around nine o'clock in the morning. Temperature's probably in the 70s, 80s. And it's climbing fast. I think today's supposed to be in the mid 90s in Reno, but I'm not in Reno right now. I probably won't be getting back to Reno until later today, much later today, because I got something I want to check out up at Tahoe. And it might be a two or three part series on this. I don't know, but uh, we'll see how that turns out, right? So, I'm gonna close out this portion right here and uh, just kind of do a, let you look and see. Look at that behind me, look at that. That's cool, huh? That's cool, that's a good shot. That might be my thumbnail. 
So I'm gonna turn it around and I'll let you guys look at my path back out to the car. And then we're gonna have to turn around and go back the direction I came because the road from this point is closed. They're already doing some heavy work on it. So uh, I'll turn it around and show you the path back out. Let's do this. Yeah, this is a beautiful area. I, I absolutely love it here. I used to come up here a lot. But traffic and crowds and construction has kind of pushed me to go to a different direction. Not to mention the prices in California. Oh, I'm sorry, I've got, yeah, yeah, I'm in the Truckee area, but now I'm in Donner. I'm on the Donner Summit in California. I don't know if I mentioned that or not, but well, getting all my mind slipping. So let's do that. Let's get back to the car. I got a water truck bearing down on me. So uh, I hope they don't spray me. Well, let's just, just see what we can do. I want to see if I can avoid a, a shower right now. Okay. I just got the go ahead. Oops, I'm stumbling and tripping. There go these brave souls. Do some rock climbing. Holy crap, this parking lot filled up in a hurry. All right, well, let's see if I can get the hell out of here. Let's do this. Okay, no problem. I got a small car.